In today's WWE 2K23 video, I got some more creative wrestlers that will be automatic alt attires to their in-game counterpart, a really cool New Japan arena, as well as the brand new undisputed title that was revealed on SmackDown. Let's get into the video. That's fatal. The first superstar I want to showcase is the Edge Pack by What's the Status in collaboration with Shattered Cause and Game Vault. Search up the hashtag EdgePack23 to find all three of these edges, and they come with three edges. The one I'm showcasing right now is Edge23, and this edge I'm showcasing comes with two attires, one with shorter hair and a more accurate beard, and then one with his hair longer and slicked back, the one I'm showcasing right now, as well as an updated beard. His hair was also slicked back using the towel glitch, where you put a towel on their head, and then on the PC, you remove the towel so their hair still stays slicked back, but there's actually a towel on their head. This edge pack will also come with Edge 01 with two attires as you can see right here, a purple and white attire as well as a white and red attire, as well as an Edge 2022 when he first joined the Judgment Day, a one with his hair shorter and then one with his hair longer using the same towel glitch. All three of these edges will be an automatic alt attire to Edge in game. So just click on Edge and then you should see all these attires pop up if you download all three. Next up, we have Lita 2023. Now, this is a really cool one. Uh, use hashtag Lita 23 alt. This was in collaboration with L2K Games as well as uh, Travis Alex. This right here is an in-game model edit. It comes with updated hair as well as an updated face texture and it will be an automatic alt attire to Lita in-game and this Lita looks spot on. It actually looks way better than the in-game model we have for Lita. So definitely try and get your hands on this Lita model uh, to download for your game. Next up, we also have Alexa Bliss 21 uploadable what's the status in collaboration with WWE 2K Gears. Use hashtag Alexa WrestleMania 37 and it is Alexa Bliss's WrestleMania 37 gear. It comes with her fun house attire as well as our Funhouse entrance. Now you can make it an alt attire to Alexa in game if you want. However, if you do that, you will lose the Funhouse entrance that is applied to this uh, Alexa Bliss, as well as the Funhouse content uh, is what it says in the description. Next up, we have K98 uploaded by What's the Status in collaboration with Tokyo Taco. Use hashtag K98Alt to find this cane. It will be an automatic alt attire to Kane 8 in game. And when I saw Tokyo Taco upload his K98, I was like, damn, that's a really good K98. Um, hopefully, What's the status makes it an automatic alt and uh turns out he did so that's really good it comes with two different attires the half sleeve attire as well as the full sleeve attire next up we have the undisputed wwe universal championship that was revealed on smackdown uploadable what's the status use hashtag undisputed 23 belt to find this now the cool thing about this undisputed wwe universal championship is that it comes with the official wwe logo next to its name uh, when you download it so it looks like it's an official in-game title so downloading this belt will make it look as official as it's going to get Next up, we have a Rey Mysterio Jr. for a tire pack uploaded by T Franklin 2021. Use hashtag Rey Mysterio T Franklin 2021 and WCW to find this Rey Mysterio Jr. pack. It comes with four different Rey Mysterios, so you can go ahead and download this and keep whichever tire you want, or just keep all four. And it's pretty much a Rey Mysterio Jr. filthy animal pack when he had no mask and he was in the filthy animals during his WCW days. It actually looks like an in-game model edit, um, but I believe it's a creative wrestler, which is kind of crazy because it really does look like Franklin just used. Uh, Rey Mysterio's like unmasked model, but I think it was actually just Creator Wrestler. Next up, we got Becky Lynch's Night of Champions attire that I wasn't able to cover in my Night of Champions attire video because it wasn't made yet, but one did get made by Baddest Savage USA. Use hashtag Becky Lynch, Night of Champions, and Seth Rollins. And you can find Becky Lynch's Kill Bill inspired attire. Now, if you want to use this attire, I recommend downloading it and then importing it over to the hidden model Becky Lynch with the longer hair so it looks more accurate. Next up, we have Candice Michelle uploaded by Lee Valentine XO. Use hashtag Candice, L2K Games, and Lee Valentine XO. This Candice Michelle was one of the top downloaded cars of the past week. So I definitely had to include it because it was a top downloaded car. And Lee Valentine did a spot on Candice Michelle. It looks really good. So good job, Lee Valentine, with this Candice Michelle. Next up, we have an Undertaker pack by Valoween. Again, this was the top download of the week. Um, first one is Undertaker 98 by Valoween. Use hashtag Undertaker, Alt, or Valoween to find all three of these Undertakers. It is pretty much a 1998 DH age Undertaker that can be an Alt for Undertaker 98 in-game. Valoween also has an Undertaker 01, which is a 2001 DH age Undertaker that will be an Alt for Undertaker 03 in-game. And then Valoween also has an Undertaker 04 to 06, 2004 2006 de aged Undertaker that will be an alt for the current Undertaker in game. So, Valoween did a great job editing these in game models of the Undertaker to de age them and make them look a lot more accurate for how they look like in that era. And finally, Marty M has created a new Japan pack that is now on the community creations that everyone should be able to download because it's just an arena. Uh, you know, there's no like props everywhere. So, if you're on PlayStation and you want to download this, you should be able to download this no problem. 
This pack includes Wrestle Kingdom 17 with Working Trons, the Core Kyoen Hall, the Kyoto KBS Hall, the Battle Autumn 2022, New Japan Ring Template, as well as variants with New Japan tables as well as buckles. And you can decide if you want to keep the tables or not. There's different variants for you to download and pick and choose from. I definitely recommend using the hashtag MartyM, search arenas, and then go through all the different arenas that MartyM has uploaded, and then pick and choose which one you want to download. Marty M has also provided a trailer for you to check out to get a better understanding of all the arenas you can find in his New Japan pack. Check it out. And that right there are a bunch of new creative wrestlers you can download, the new undisputed WWE Championship belt, as well as the new Japan Arena pack from Marty M. I hope you enjoyed the video. Be sure to give it a like, subscribe to the down, and I'll catch you next video. Video Steven out. Peace.